you're watching this video because this mortgage thing might be Greek to you. It might be a misunderstanding and how do I start? All these questions, I hear so many numbers and people's experiences, sometimes positive, sometimes negative. How do I understand? So in this video, we're going to discuss the Guild Value Formula. There are lots of moving parts to a mortgage, but we can actually simplify this process. And this formula does just that. At the end of our discussion, I want you to realize that this is about coming up with your monthly payment. The thing that comes out of your checking account for 10, 15, 30 years. And then it's also about how you feel about it. Everything we do is an experience and how we feel about it at the end of the day. The formula is interest rate plus term, mortgage insurance, closing costs, buy down or discount points, escrows, and homeowner association fees. Over experienced professionals, choices, transparency, communication, in-house staff, and make your payment to us. This is the Guild Value Formula. Well, let's get into each one of these. Now, interest rate, that is certainly the question everybody has and probably the reason I'm making this formula because if that's the only question that's ever asked, there's so many other variables. The interest rate, by the way, is very important to understand. There are approximately 35 different indicators out there that determine a person's interest rate. Size of the loan, um, term, credit score, what type of loan, what county it's in, what type of property, and so on. It's also important to understand that that interest rate cannot be locked in until we have a full application and a contract if you're purchasing a home. Hence, when you go shopping online and looking, those are not real interest rates because they haven't taken in consideration the 35 points or we don't have an application for you specifically or an address of a property. I also have to add on interest rates that they change throughout the day. This is not something that's static on a single day. They happen to be different in the morning, possibly by the afternoon. Next is term. Literally, a 30-year, a 15, a 10-year term. The shorter the term, the lower the interest rate. Next, we have mortgage insurance. Now, mortgage insurance is only a part of these fees if you have a small down payment. That insurance then protects the lender in case of default because there's less equity in the home. Closing costs. Closing costs are all of the, everybody else. We call them third party vendors. So it's my job to make sure I include the title company's fees, the appraiser's fees, the credit report fees, not just a fee that may have come from my company, but all of the people's fees to get that mortgage loan done. Next are discount points or buy down points. And these are optional. This is where you actually increase your closing costs to prepay or buy down the interest rate. The next part of your monthly payment are what we call the escrows or reserves to pay your property taxes and your home insurance. Now these are not necessarily fees of a mortgage, but they certainly are to be considered when you are qualifying for a monthly payment. And each house is different depending upon which company you use for insurance and what type of house it is. Next are HOA fees or homeowner association fees, and that just depends on the property. If it's a planned unit development, they'll have them. If not, they won't. This totals your total monthly payment. We call it P-I-T-I-A, Principal, Interest, Taxes, Insurances, and possibly HOA. This is the top section of the Guild Mortgage Formula. What I have found is that as people focus on the numbers, the monthly payment, they actually need to realize too that this is a huge life decision. And I believe how it feels or the actual experience is critical. So this is why the next section of this formula is so important. To start with, to have an experienced professional, years in the business. I have to tell you, if someone has two, three, four, five years in the business, they've only seen the best. They've only seen a really good economy. If they've had five, 10, 15, 20, they've seen the ups and the downs that much experience to make sure that you have all of the data in front of you, I think is critical. Next are choices. You want to have a company that's large enough, Guild Mortgage, that has multiple, multiple products from first time home buyers to large purchases, to those who are looking to build a home, to invest in property and so forth. Next is transparency. You have a lot of trust in this situation. I think you should see 
behind the screen. I think you should see how rates are calculated. To see what's going on, meet the staff. Be able to have a relationship and a connection. Transparency of the numbers and of the process. You know exactly what's going on at all times. Next is communication. And there's two sides of communication. That's electronic and personal. When you have automated updates, every time the appraisal is ordered, an email is sent out saying, appraisal ordered. When the appraisal comes back, appraisal received. Submitted to underwriting and so forth. We call those milestones. But having it electronically, an email sent out, keep you updated knowing exactly the processes and where it's going. There's also phone calls. Hey, just so you know, we sent the appraisal in and it came in at the certain value and looks good and by tomorrow at three o'clock we'll have it into the underwriter. Any questions? Anything we do for you? Great, thanks. Now so far I've explained the things that you're going to see on your side. I want to explain a couple things that happen on the back end on my side. I cannot emphasize to you the importance of having an in-house staff. The underwriter, the closer, there's a shipper, quality control, funder, okay there's a lot of people all of them working together on your loan. Having an in-house staff literally empowers me to make sure I take care of you. And last but not least, we service or keep the majority of our loans. Most of the loans we do stay right here at Guild Mortgage. You make your payment to us. So if you're one of those people who says, hey, what's your interest rate? I hope you can see a bigger picture. You can see it's not just interest rate, but it's fees and closing costs and buy-downs. And not only is it just about the numbers, it's about the entire experience. So I invite you to come and have the Guild experience, wherein you will be able to understand and see the entire Guild value formula in action.